welcome to Sonya's View on this channel. Today is October 30th, 2013, and we're standing in front of one of my favorite stores, this thrift store. As I told you once before, every last Wednesday of the month, they have an additional 50% off. As you can see, the parking lot is rather full. They open up at 7 o'clock, so, so if you have like a value village for a thrift store in your area, check it out and see what great deals they may have during the entire month but for this particular store the value village and there are quite quite a few of them in georgia but this one this is the bum we're gonna go inside and see what they have i grew up on shopping at thrift stores i love shopping at thrift stores today as you can see how i am dressed i have on a skirt and underneath this skirt i have on some leggings i put some leggings on because you're going to want to try these things on and believe this i have on two pair of undergarments because like i stated you're going to want to try the things on because you can bring them back if they do not fit but the thing is you're going to get a store credit and that i do not want a store credit so we're going to go inside and check out what they have but mainly i came today because i wanted some jogging suits or some um, yeah, some jogging suits for the winter time. So let's go inside and check out and see what they have. Come on, let's go. Okay, we're on the inside of the thrift store and it's kind of junky today. I'm going to try not to record anybody because I don't want anybody all up in my business. Okay. <clears throat> but we're going to walk over to the other side because, like I say, the only thing I really wanted to purchase today was jogging suits. But I may come across some other great deals, so we're going to see what they have. And a lot of people are over here in that section right now in the dry suit section. Take a look. Okay, I guess everybody had the same idea because there's a lot of people over here looking at the dry suits. And there, there's really not that many dry suits. So. Um, maybe I can find me some blazers if I don't find any dry suits. Which I really don't need any blazers, but we're going to still take a look. Let's go check it out. Okay, I've come across this particular blazer. That is beautiful, and it's five dollars and forty-nine cents. So it's going to be like two dollars and twenty-five cents. Now, this would be a great place for a lot of the filming um, production companies to come to get some prop clothes or background clothes for your extras. This would be a good place to come on this particular day because, like I said, the sales are very reasonable, and you can get some great things. I'm going to try that on. That is really cute. Okay, here's another beautiful dress I just came across. This will be shop with a blazer. Oh, that is so cute. And it's only $8. It says the size large, but it's not. It's a size 5, 6. And it's only $8.49. So that would be half of that. That is beautiful. Look at that stitching on there and the double buttons across the breast, across the waistline. I'm sorry. That waistline. Uh, okay, let's keep looking. Since I've been in the store, I've been stopped by stuff talking about my mascara. It is by Maybelline. Maybelline has it for two dollars and sixty-nine cents. There's one particular dress this lady just found. I want that dress, but she's gonna keep it. So I'm over here in the dress section trying to find something. Nice. I found this suit. This is a beautiful suit. Casper? That is beautiful. We're going to try that jacket on. With a pretty cream top. Isn't that beautiful? Look at, this. Look at the detail on the sleeve. It's a match with the buttons going down. I love this and it fits perfectly. Here's the skirt. I'm not going to try the skirt on, but I like this. Um, another thing I came across, this is like a two-piece suit, and this is by, I'm going to say, Liz Claiborne. This is so strong, but it has like a stain on the jacket. I'm going to see, can I get it out? To me, it's worth still buying, just for the jacket alone. Isn't that beautiful? Look there. Now this is the stain I was talking about. It's the stain going across the shop the aura. Isn't that beautiful? I'm gonna take a chance and buy it. And see can I get the stain to come out? Because I like this. I like the color, the peach color. It is so beautiful. Let's see what should I find? The 
Now, you know, y'all know I have a thing for blazers, right? So I came across this blazer. I love this blazer. And it has all the fall colors inside of it. And this is a very Pace OTD. I don't know who that is. I'm not really a name brand person. But I like it. Let's try it on. Look at that fit. Mmm. Mmm. Look at that fit. I like this. Put me a pair of leggings and a thin top to go up under it. I really like this blazer. So I'm going to get this one as well. And there were several other things that I came across that I wanted. So this blazer is like $5.49. So it's going to be like half of what the $5.49. I came across this suit. That's beautiful. And that's $8. I'm gonna get this one as well. And the buttons across. Look at that. Look how detailed that is. The buttons over on the left hand side. I love the color on me too. So I'm gonna get this as well. Now, I tried this on. I, I like this dress because it has the detail going down the side of it. I messed up one of the buttons. I got to get that repaired, get that fixed, but I'm going to get this. I like this dress. And this is a Maggie London. Never heard of it before, but I'm going to get that. And also, I picked up. That is cute. It's kind of different. This lady in the store actually picked it out for me. She was picking out a lot of my clothing. This is cute with a pair of jeans. Let me get this. It's different. Now, I kind of like this, but it's kind of up in the air whether or not I'm going to buy it. It's a signature by Larry Levine. It's a size 14. I kind of like it. It's a, just a tad bit too big, but I think it's kind of cute. I think I'm going to get it. So on days that I don't want to wear my real heavy coats, my big thick coats, I can wear that. And then I found this scarf. It's $3.99, so I will get that half price as well. I really like this. I'll be getting this as well. So, so far, that's all that I have. I'm going to go on the other side and see what they have on that side. But um, I think that's all I'm going to buy today because, as I said earlier, my goal was to spend only $30. I think I've gone over 30 but we will check it out once we get to the cash, um, the counter to check out. So stay tuned. There's more to come. Okay, I finished looking at the clothes. As you can see on that wall, they have a wall full of hats. Some nice hats. They're only like a dollar, two dollars, and then 50% off. Now, on the household items, you're not going to receive that. It's priced as mark. But they have some nice stuff. Some nice baskets. It's kind of looking junky in here today to me. Normally, they have a little bit more organized. I don't know what happened. But yeah. Like this platter. This is cute for two dollars. Look at that. That's only two dollars. That is cute. I'm gonna get this. Yeah, it's only two dollars. That's cute. I think I'm gonna buy this today. It's only two, so. Pick up these stuff. I'm dropping stuff everywhere. Okay, we're gonna go around and look on the other side to see what they have. I don't normally buy people cups and bowls and stuff that I'm going to have to eat or drink out of. Certain things you just don't want to buy from a thrift store. Unless it looks brand new and you don't, you know, you feel comfortable with it. But me personally, I'm just not going to do it. Look at this. It's one of those hot curlers that you plug in and it has all the, all the curlers plus some body hair inside of it. We're not going to get that. That is a no-no. Let's look around some more. Hmm. Kind of winding down because I don't see anything else that I really want. I always like to look for odd stuff when I come in here. I like this. So I can redo this and put something inside of it. 
But if I take this home, my kids gonna have a fit. Why you keep buying this stuff? And you know we don't need it. But it's only $3. So should I get it or should I leave it? Let's put it in the basket in my cart just in case. Because like I told you, I don't want to spend over $30, but look like it's over $30 in its basket. Look at these hats. This is like a NASCAR sprint hat. That's like two or three dollars. I mean, they got some really nice hats. I like this. This is like a Georgia Aquarium hat, and it's brand new. They want like four dollars for it, so half of that four is gonna be two dollars. Pillows, I don't need. Let's go around the other side. I think this is gonna do it for me, y'all. I think I'm gonna go sit in the corner and um, take inventory on what I have. It may have to downsize some things because. What is that? That's cute. I should sit it in the kitchen. I don't know. that lampshade that's different I could sit that on my porch because you know I have a lamp outside on my porch and I may need a lampshade five dollars this ain't half price do I want to pay five dollars for this because it would look nice on my porch seriously well, I don't think I want to pay five dollars today for no lampshade I found a lampshade at a garage sale for like 50 cents so I ain't paying it today Look at this light. It's kind of different. It's kind of ragged tail too. But it's different. Oh, no, 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 no. Look at this one right here. Damn, y'all, why it got to be $10? Look at that one. Isn't that different? I like it. I don't know if I'm going to pay $10. What y'all think? It's on you so cheap. Yep, you're right. You were right. If you thought it, you're right. I am very cheap. That is beautiful though. I'm gonna go over here and plug it up and see if it works. But yeah, they got ten dollars on this bad baby, and it's heavy. Stay tuned, y'all. I can't try to plug it up and talk at the same time. So stay tuned. Let me see what's going on with this lamp. Okay, I came over here to this other section. Do you believe they have 45-inch records? And look at this one right here. I wish I had a 45-inch player or stereo. That is a temptation, and the title of it. I couldn't cry if I wanted to. Dang, I wish I had a 45 player. I wish I had a record player. They got some nice old songs, and I love me some old, old music. Just walking in the rain. Don't be cruel. this old RCA 45 inch record. I remember growing up having my mother having a, a record player and then the needle would jump out and you have to put the needle back in and we would sit there for hours just listening to old old songs. Well at the time they weren't old songs but now they're considered to be old songs. I love, love, love R&B old songs. Wish they still have some VHS movies. Oh, look at here, The Lost World. Let's see, how much are the VHS? Oh, they're only 60 cents for VHS. But you know what? With these 45-inch records, that would be decorative. Yeah, I mean, it, it would be nice if you could put it in a room and be very creative with that. But I would just like to have it for the history of the um, the records itself. I think I would do all that. Okay, y'all, I gotta sit in the corner, go ahead and sort out what I have because I am going downsize. Sometimes I get a little bit excited when I come in here. They have furniture too. Nothing I would like, but. Oh, and that lamp that I had in my hand, how about it popped when I plugged it up? So you know I put that back right. Okay, 
So let's go sit in the corner and count up everything I have. They also carry books. So if you want to like to read, this would be a good place to come and buy some books. They usually have some really nice books. Joel Osteen, Your Best Life Now. How much is this book? Three dollars, y'all. I think I'm gonna invest in this. I want this book. This one, that's cute for Halloween. Look at that. That's a cute little book. If I can get it open. And I can't get it open. That's crazy. No, I can't get it open. And look at the title, Scary Stories. Well, damn, it must be a secret. We're going to put that back because I can't even get it open. Flower. Oh, flavor of the week. I don't know why I'm picking up all these books. No, good well, I ain't going to read not one. But I'm going to get Joe's old scene because I do. I like listening to him. Uh, I like listening to him sometimes on Sundays when he comes on. A lot of books to go through, though. Mm -hmm. A lot of kids' books as well. Some nice books, too. Uh oh, they got Betty White. Here we go again. I'm gonna put that back. I know I ain't reading that one. Mm -hmm. Yes, 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 yes. Okay, people. I'm going to find me a spot. I'm going to find this watch. I said, hold on. You going to keep on repeating the same thing again? Oh, Stop okay. it. He in trouble. I'm in the city of Atlanta, so you come across the crazy-ass people. <gasps> now, look at here now. Look at here. Look at here. The new cookie book. More than 150 great cookies. Cookies, biscuit, bars, and brownie recipes. How much is this book? Y'all better get off over here in this section. I'm gonna get this book. But then again, you know I like stuff that's simple. I ain't trying to, uh, I'll come up with my own recipe first. That butter cookie look kind of good. What you think? Mm-hmm. I thought the same thing, too. Look at that. Well, no. This is so much work. Hell no. That's a nice book, but no. Not today. Okay, I've been in this store since 9. Might as well just say I've been in this store since 10 o'clock. I'm going to go ahead and check out now. Get it so possibly. Oh, I thought my lens had a crack in it. I think it's around about 2 o'clock, so let's go ahead and check out and see how much I'm going to spend. It's going to be over $30. Let's go to check out. Okay, so now we're at the checkout count. I'm going to see how much I'm going to spend, and then I'm going to come back and show you my receipt to show you how much I've actually spent on the items that I have on the counter. So stay tuned. There is more to come. Okay, can you believe I have finally come out this store? I have been in this store since 10 a.m. this morning, and it is now 2 o'clock. But I found some great things on my shopping adventure inside of the thrift store i purchased three bags of goodies that we're going to go over later on but i only spent 68 dollars and 77 cents you cannot beat that so if you have a value village in your town you want to check them out the last wednesday of every month to really get those great deals so i hope you have enjoyed the time we've shared together until next time be blessed